In today's Madden 21 tip, I'm going to show you how to bomb every single coverage in Madden 21, including the meta man-to-man -man coverage. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. If you've never been a part of my YouTube channel before, what my channel does is basically we try to help people get better at Madden. And we do that through a variety of ways, but one of the ways we do that is through posting four times a day here on YouTube free tips, free strategies, free schemes, and free concepts that you can utilize in your own scheme. And so if that's something that interests you, I want to encourage you right now to go down to the bottom right of the screen and click that subscribe button. That way you don't miss an upload. And also, we live stream every single night around 10 o'clock Eastern in time and so you want to catch those live streams you want to be sure to be subscribed that way you know whenever we go live all right guys so I wanted to talk about this play and this is actually a play that we um, we discovered in a live lab session that I did on the channel uh, you can get access to that if you haven't checked that live lab session out it's really really good I talk a lot about um, specifically kind of how I go about labbing how I go about you know the process of all of those things and so if you want to check that out, feel free to check out the, uh, the uh, channel and you can get access to that video. But I wanted to show you kind of the finalized product and what came out of it was what I believe to be one of the best plays in Madden NFL 21, especially for beating the defense over the top. So what you want to do is you want to put your best wide receiver at the far right side of the screen here. We're going to put Devontae Adams in that position. And then we're going to put Equanimous St. Brown here, and we're going to put Marquez Valdez Scantling here. Now, the play you're going to come out in, it's in your audibles as well, but it's called PA Read. And you're going to see that this play will not only beat man to man, it will beat every single coverage in Madden NFL uh, 21 over the top for a one play score. So I'm just going to cycle through, and we're going to run this against cover three, uh, cover three cloud, uh, cover two, as well as cover four. I don't know about you, but I've been getting a lot of cover four, and cover four is a lot harder to beat this year. This also beats man to man. It actually beats man to man um, over the top uh, with cover zero uh, as well as with the deep blues that's what's really cool about it is they're literally I mean there's some very intentional lies uh, stuff that they're gonna have to do but first and foremost I want to show you this against cover two so this is just standard cover two and all you're gonna you don't even have to block the running back but you can if you want added pass protection but what you're gonna see is Devonte Adams when he cuts to the inside is gonna absolutely crush the cover two defense over the top as you see there easy one play score very very simple so that's the cover two defense we're now going to shift to cover four, and cover four is a little bit better um, suited to stop this, but it still won't. You'll see that Devontae Adams is going to be able to uh, get over the top of these safeties because it's such a deep breaking route. Wait till he passes um, over the top of that other safety, and as you see there, it's going to beat cover four for about 50, 60 yards. A really, really good play. I want to show you this one more time against cover four. You want to make sure that you're waiting on the route to come open. And by waiting on the route to come open, what I simply mean is waiting until he crosses that safety. Um, you do need pass protection to be able to uh, throw this. That's why I actually recommend go ahead and block your running back. It's going to help a little bit with this specific play. So we're going to block the running back here. And what you'll see is against cover four defense, and a lot of people running max you know, max coverage defenses. But once he passes that uh, safety, you're going to see he's going to beat it right over the top of the defense. Now I want to shift gears and I want to talk about the cover three defense. Cover three is probably going to cover this the best out of all the coverages. Uh, and the way that I get around that is by smart routing Vontae Adams. You can smart route this route. It's going to make it kind of um, slide against the cover three. And essentially what's going to happen is if they're in cover three, um, he is going to cross I don't know why the safety did that right there. Oh, wow, crazy catch. But what you'll see is against most cover three defenses, Devontae Adams is going to come underneath the deep blue zone in the middle of the field, and he's actually going to torch the deep blue zone on the left side of the field. So we're going to just kind of wait for the, the pocket to develop here. But once he gets across right there, and you'll see part of this I think is because we have auto flip on. But what you'll find is against the cover three cloud, it actually beats it even more. So I'm going to show the play real quick. And you'll see um, if we flip this play, I'm sorry, not flip this play. If we leave this play just like this, you'll see Devontae Adams' route is going to kill the cover three cloud defense. Let me show you right here. Again, smart route that route. Just wait for him to come across and pass lead all the way to the left. And as you see there, it's going to torch that cover three. So cover three does give it probably the most amount of trouble. But once he gets past that deep blue zone, and that's why smart routing the route is so effective, once he gets past that deep blue zone, 
um, you can just pass lead him to the left right there if he's even he's leaving click on and you see Devontae Adams is going to get that catch as long as you click on the receiver and make a play now the last defense that I want to go over is cover two man uh, cover two man is probably going to be what most people are going to try to do to stop this um, and I'm not quite sure if Devontae Adams will beat Stephon Gilmore over the top he should um, he'll beat any corner that doesn't have ability so um, Devontae Adams, or um, Stephon Gilmore does have one step ahead but I'm pretty sure Devontae Adams will beat this. You'll see here, he's going to get that cut right there, pass lead up, and you see um, Stephon Gilmore is probably the best cornerback in the game. Any other corner that's going to beat it over the top for a one-play score, uh, we'll show you this again real quick. But this is the shading coverage outside, shading coverage over the top, and it has two deep blues on the field. And what you're going to see here is Devontae Adams once he makes that final cut, if you pass lead that well, you are oftentimes going to get that separation against the man-to-man -man coverage. It's actually going to work even better if they leave the press coverage. So you see here, if they press coverage, um, you're going to get that little bit of a reroute, but then Devontae Adams' route running is going to take over. And as you see here, you're going to be able to beat man-to-man -man coverage over the top for an absolute uh, bomb. And then if they take the safeties away, it's even better. So you'll see uh, a lot of times, though, you'll see the shade coverage out, shade, the shade coverage over top look. All you got to do, again, just run that route to Devontae Adams. He's going to torch it over the top. Make sure to finish your throws. And as you see there, um, you're going to get a lot of that right there. One of the things that I will tell you to do with this route, especially against man-to-man -man coverage, is when you throw the ball, you want to pass lead it up, and you want to kind of hold the pass lead as soon as you've thrown it. So after you've thrown it, keep holding up on the joystick. It's going to help a lot with this route. Um, I'm sorry, I forgot to take the safeties. Um, if you pass lead it, if, if their safeties are over top like that, then you're just going to simply pass lead it. Um, you're simply going to pass lead it up and to the left. But just kind of hold your pass lead just a little bit after you make that throw. It's going to give just a little bit better separation. And as you can see right there, get the ball out there a little bit more. Um, but it's going to be an absolute dot. One thing I've actually just kind of experimented with with this play is um, high pointing it. So basically, because you're trying to get the ball out there, because he's going to get that, he's got that over the top uh, positioning. So if you, if you throw it with a high point, it's going to get the trajectory on the ball is going to get a little bit higher. And it's going to get out there. But again, guys, this is one of the best routes that nobody's talking about in the game. It's, these, it's a little bit of a more inverted S route. You see here, it's kind of angled and slanted a little bit more vertically. And this post route specifically, I think, is probably the best route for beating man-to-man -man, uh, in the game. Again, Stephon Gilmore, you know, he's the best corner. But if you take Stephon Gilmore out of the picture and if you were running this against any other corner in the game, um, this is going to work. It's still going to work against Stephon Gilmore. You just have to kind of pay attention to it, kind of monitor things. Um, but you'll see right there, able to get that animation, nice diving catch there from Devontae Adams to wrap up the video. So, guys, if you want the full scheme from the Arizona Cardinals playbook, we have several more plays in our playbook that are better than just this play. Um, but I did want to share this with you. If you want to get the full scheme, you can pick it up in the description. There's a link where you can get my Madden 21 competitor's guide. It has my full offense, my full defense. Offense, I run Arizona, and on defense, I run the 4 6. By picking up the ebooks, you're going to be able to get access to the entire schemes that we run out of those playbooks. So be sure to pick those up. Also, you can catch me playing live tonight on uh, YouTube at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you tonight on live stream.